Hello everybody and welcome back to another video here on the Monkey Games A Lot channel. I am your host Monkey Master and as you can see I am back here giving you another video inside of our Rainbow Challenge series. So in the last episode of the Rainbow Challenge series I spent a long time um, trying to get into this cave um, and yeah I literally didn't get any further than this. And the entrance to the cave is just there. So, didn't get very far. Um, I kept dying. I died a lot in the last episode. And hopefully that won't happen again in this death episode. And what I'm looking for is I'm looking for Lapis Lazuli. Because Lapis Lazuli is very useful for all the different types of dyes. You need it for, like, um, Cyan. You need it for Lapis Lazuli. Obviously the blue dye. Um, you... The light blue dye you can make it really easily with the lapis lazuli so lapis lazuli is very important it is completely compulsory to get so i need to go and get some but unfortunately i'm just gonna make the screen a bit brighter i don't actually know um how like let's see if i can get that creeper to explode oh no that my my sword blew up oh did it not oh it didn't blow up cool um Hence why I couldn't attack anything, because my sword was on the ground. Um, I don't actually know, like, whether there's a particular level. You, well, I know you need to be at a particular level, but I'm not sure what that level is, like, how common Lapis Lazuli is. I don't think it's rare, but um, it's also not really common as well. So we might have to do some hunting. I'm not sure how long this will take, so... Um, We'll just have to explore around until we find some, I guess. Um, can't see anything around here. It might be useful to like block up some of these water currents, just because they can be like a real nuisance. So the smart way to do this is to do it like that, so it kind of just flows into there, and then it will go away. But if you would just block it, it would kind of just go around the block. So. You need to do that very carefully if you're ever trying to do that. It's a good good little tip just there to remember. Um, I don't know if I'll actually be... Oh, there we go. How did I miss that? It's literally right at the entrance to the cave. Oh, now the question is, can I break it with a stone pickaxe? Oh, I can. Oh, that's really useful, actually. I don't need an iron pickaxe. Looks like we got quite a few. It's literally right at the entrance to the cave. And I... Oh, right. I'm going to have to get rid of something. Um... Mm, we need leather. Leather's really useful. How did I... G I don't even know how I got glowstone dust. And I don't know want to know how I got glowstone dust. I think I defeated a witch in the last episode. And witches can drop glowstone dust because they make their potions and you can use glowstone dust in potions. And it's the scariest mob in the game. It is a zombie with an iron shovel. I'm gonna die. I'm so gonna die. Um, let's break this block here. And let's break this one here as well, like that. And, oh, oh, he's moving away. Where's he going? Right, you know I'm over here, right? Yeah, he does. I think he does. Die, die, and die. There we go. Okay, so now what I want to do is move all my stuff around so that basically my um, all the blocks I've got are in my hotbar so I can use them to pile up so I don't actually have that many blocks and I can't guarantee I'll even be able to make it back up to the surface with the blocks I've got but it's always worth a try so where am I trying to get to I'm trying to get all the way up there yeah this is so impossible <laughs> um it m I might end up having to like mine up and then kind of like using the blocks I've got from mining up to go higher because that's that's like a good tactic um yeah but we have come into some dirt here so let's break the dirt away like that let's use the dirt to pile up a bit like that and then use the stone I'll well, use my pickaxe here to break the stone break the stone like that and use my shovel to break that oh we've got some coal here coal's always useful let's break away the coal and um, like that let's use this dirt to pile up like that and use that andesite there like that 
put that there and we made it and now we've just got to not die and make it back to the surface I can't actually remember how you get up to the surface so this may take a while um, but we've got lot, plenty of iron here and iron's awesome so let's mine away this iron I mean to be honest this challenge is quite a peaceful challenge you don't you do, I don't think you need to go to the nether for anything I don't think you need to go to the end for anything so to be honest with you it's quite a nice peaceful little challenge like um, there's no real need for any of the really strong resources like diamonds but in most of the um, challenges and um, e even like most of the series in general that I'll be doing on this channel um, I will be like needing diamonds for stuff so yeah this this might this will probably be one of the only series on the channel unless it's like a creative series this will probably be one of the only series on the channel you'll ever see me not need to get diamonds so enjoy it because getting diamonds can be quite a nuisance to be honest with you quite a nuisance indeed oh my goodness what's that oh goodness i'm actually terrified now please don't be night up here it's night oh it's raining it's raining okay um, not brilliant. Is it night though? That's the question. Yeah, it's night. Um, where's my bed? I know I've got a bed somewhere. So if I can find the bed, oh, it's over here. Fair enough. Right, we got a creeper and a spider a little bit in the way. So let's come out here. Let's eat. Let's grab some food. Right, got to do this safely here. Grab some food like this. And now if I come up here and hit the creeper he should explode there we go now let's kill the spider like that oh and i could do with killing some squid actually because obviously you need ink for some of the dyes so um killing squid would be quite useful there we go some ink sacks how many ink sacks have i got i've got two so um maybe a couple more in fact no let's sleep and then we can get a couple more when it's daytime and safer and not completely horrible. There we go. That's a better idea. Let's go to sleep. Right, there we go. It's all nice and peaceful now. Well, as peaceful as it can get here. And now let's... Just, oh, I my sword broke. I've just got to punch it. Die, squid! Die, squid! Die. Who's looking forward to the update that will like add more water mobs i'm really looking forward to that one but i'm not sure how many i'll like, I'll, like be able to find in kind of like my world's like monkey land because it might be that certain biomes are necessary for them to spawn and i won't be able to get those biomes because obviously um it's a it's an already created world and you can't get new biomes or new structures or anything like that in a um in a world that's already been created so Hopefully it's not like the, the the animals are specific to a certain biome and that it's they um, Spawn they just spawn in the ocean biome, but I do know they're talking about like um, adding some new biomes I think some of the it might have been like the um, coral reef biome the um, What were the other ones it was like the The, the something or other biome. Oh, maybe the, I think they were maybe a kelp forest biome or at least a place where you can find kelp um so i'm definitely looking forward to it i'm just hoping that i'll be able to access some of the things um in monkey land naturally rather than having to having to cheat because i don't want to cheat cheating is not cheating is not good you do not cheat in minecraft cheating is bad so there's not really much more to do um i traveled here outside of episode and it took me a little while to travel here so i um, think i'm gonna travel back outside of episode just so i don't bore you um with me trying to get back because it will probably take quite a while and yeah i don't want to bore you like that and we are just about running out of time in this episode now anyway so if you've enjoyed this episode here make sure you check out the link in the description which will take you straight to the next episode in our rainbow challenge series in which we we will be back at home trying to figure out our next move to completing the goals of this series however until then i'll be seeing you all later goodbye